Hi, my name is Ray, and I'm here to talk to you about uh, the TJI Spark, uh, all the stuff I have to go with it, and for me when I go on my travels. A lot of people say that they can't charge the battery, they you know, uh, use a power pack. Now, I've got a power pack, but I don't think it works that good. Other people may find it does, but for me it doesn't. I've got different ways of using it. Um, before I tell you that, uh, I'm in the UK now and I bought my DJI Spark in America. Or well, my sister ordered it for me for when I went over there. Um, I have crashed it. Uh, DJI had no problem whatsoever of replacing it. Um, so, you know, I have no issues with that. And DJI now have gone actually better than Apple. They're easier to contact. They, they actually monitor Facebook. And if someone says something um, derogatory towards them, someone contacts them and says can they help them and how can we sort something out for you and I think they're great now where when I first got my phantoms like they were absolutely impossible to catch up with and uh, so a lot of that is good right for this what have I got right I've, I've got a bag I don't know dummy running on this uh, table here uh, it makes a loud noise so I'm not going to be put on there in my bag I, I carry a mic I bought this mic that cost me $9.95. For $9.95 I also carry this in with me. This also goes for my iPad. So when I do a shoot, I can put it into my iPad, either edit it in there or take a look what it looks like and see if I'm happy with it. And then I can carry on from there. So that goes in there. Got lots of little things in there for the mic. Just the ordinary stud mic. Got a few. Um, I've got a little different connector there. I don't know what that's actually for to be honest with you, but it comes with it. Another, this is my wind mic. Got a clip on, so it actually clips here. If I can show you quickly. Yeah, just clips there. And I use this on my iPhone, but the only problem is I've got the iPhone 7 Plus, so I have to use the adapter. Typical, isn't it? I've got another wind mic, a smaller one, or wind shield, and a couple of the studs and clips. All that for $9.95. I think it's great. Got that on eBay, by the way. I think they've got Lavia mics. Or well, someone can correct me if I'm wrong. So, that goes in the side package. Put that back in there. It's, this bag cost me... I think this was $12.99. Everything gets into it. As you can see on the back, which I love a lot. This is my shield for the sun for my iPad. It's one of the few that I've seen where the iPad just goes in it takes seconds to put together and I'm really happy with the fact of that. So that's quite good. iPad fits in the back. So again, as I say, seconds to put together. As he says, obviously different because I'm doing this one here. I not to make too much noise because I know how sensitive the mic is. Yeah, and that's done. And that's what it looks like. So that is great. I think that was a tenny. Ten pounds. For the only Americans watching. Uh, so I'm happy, really happy with that. I'll carry that. Obviously that goes on one of these. It's a shun scale. But these, they've also got the little case inside with the I don't know if you can see that I haven't got any filters yet but that's what it's for so you can carry your filters and it names them all just click that over there I'm happy with that again on my travels I've got a helipad fold up helipad which is really good stop them getting wet what else have we got on here in the side there I just want to zip that. That's where all my props go. Just show you one, don't need to show you, show you them all. But they all fit in there comfortably. Let me see what now. So that's where my props go. I do have the bag, uh, what I got, because I got a combo pack. Uh, mm, I think it's rubbish to be honest with you. Inside here, there's my casing. I'll just take the two batteries out of there and I can flip it over off the phone. 
I have a non-eater for the wins, which I find really good. That was $6.99 on eBay, brand new, not second hand. And there you've got the case and how it all holds. Stupidly, I ordered the green one. When I got the combo pack, I ordered the green one. Um, that falls in the grass, you can't even find it. So what have I got in here? I've got my props in here. I've got on-the-go leads there. Uh, you don't need to use them anymore. People say you do, but I haven't needed to. Obviously, I've got the little thing to hold the uh, sticks. That's fine. And then, obviously, I've got six batteries. The two are going on top. Three, four, five, and six. And that's it. Which is really good. The other thing that I have is then, because this bag is so tight, and it's great for it to be that tight, by the way, um, this is just to protect it because it's so tight. And that's just a, a clear shield. Now, as I said before, it was green when I got it. Couldn't find it in the grass, couldn't see it in the grass, so I done it in red. I can see this red, and I haven't got the greatest of eyesight, for quite a good distance. You couldn't see the green when I was flying. So the red really stands out. You can get other colours that stand out, I don't know what's the best, but I know the red one does me. Like, what I want really to show you is, I'll just put this away a sec, or I'll put it down. Play the wrong way. I'll put that down over here a sec. What I really wanted to show you is how I charge my batteries while I'm away. I have no problem whatsoever. So if, when I say I'm away, if I'm going on travel with my car, right? So, let me just take this. I use the proper DJI uh, battery charging pack that comes with it. Comes with the combo that is, so it comes with three. So they just slide in. I have all my batteries numbered, so I use them one to six. And then when that's on, I'll go back to number one. So they've all got the same amount of power uh, being taken out and all being used. Right. And I've got this. This is a 300 watt car power converter. Only slight problem I have with this is this is not long enough, but I am going to buy an extra lead that goes to the battery of my car and goes right through my dash. That's what I wanted to do. At the moment, I have to open the door, open the bonnet, connect it up, shut the bonnet, shut the door, and it's a little bit short. But as you can see, if you can read that and try and get you there, it's a 300 watt. Does USB as well. As you can see there, USB on the side. Oh, sorry, I've got the wrong side here because it's a different way. USB. And I reckon, I honestly reckon, it charges the three batteries up between 30 and 40 minutes. It probably, um, you probably get quicker if you just want one charged up. But, you know, probably do less than that, I think. People don't believe me when I say it, but now people have come out with me. Uh, they're quite shocked at how good this is. So I'll read this out to you what it says. It's a, it converts 12 volt DC to 230 volts AC, 50 hertz power. It, it's a 300 watt. Oh, sorry, that's <laughs> my phone's talking to me now. It's a 300 watt converter with a 600 watt peak. Converts 12V, 12 volts DC to USB 5 volts DC, 1000 milliamps. So that's great for that. It was, I bought that in Halfords, which is in UK. I'm sure you can, if anyone watching in the States, this will be a magnetic glass is sticking to it. Anyone getting this in the States, you'd probably get it from Radio Shack or somewhere like that, or Best Buy. And this was £30, and you can't argue with that. Oh, by the way, that just clicks into there. It's got an on off switch. But the charger yeah, just plugs in as normal. You guys will probably have something on the audio in the US have that. You'll, you'll probably get one that just goes straight through. But with me being in the UK, I wanted one with the uh, three prong. Right, so that's that. What else do I carry with me? To go with my phone, let me just turn this off, of course. I have one of these if it's sunny, as well as the other one. This is my phone one, and these are great. So, and all that does again, fits in the bottom and the leaves go and clip on top. Really is good. 
I carry different types. I bought these. These are hit and miss. These are for when the blade's going to put them away. You'll get like three sets fit and then the fourth set won't fit properly. But it's still better than nothing. I have two lots of legs. I find if I have these legs on, you can't put the prop guards on. So no good, that's why I've got two. I can't show you the other proper legs because I'm filming this on a Hero 3 Plus and it's actually, that's what the stand what it's for, what I've got it on. And I can't show you my um, battery pack, what I carry with it. Cause I don't believe the battery packs do this well. I know they're supposed to be USB chargeable. It takes forever, so they're no good. That's why I use that. Probably great if you don't, you know, you're not got your car with you and you're walking in the mountains or whatever. Brilliant for that, maybe. But it still takes about, I don't know, five hours to charge them. And I've got a really good battery pack there. Uh, and that's charging my phone, uh, sorry, my uh, Hero 3, because my batteries are dead on that. But that's what I've got in mind. Hope you enjoyed it. Hope it gave you uh, some insight to what goes on and how you can charge things. DJI are getting to be one of the best companies in the world, um, especially for... Uh, the after sale service it's really unbelievable com compared to what they were beforehand all over the world you've got them going because i've spoke to guys who are in italy when i've spoke to them because i always go if you want to talk to tgi uh, i go on the uh, i chat you know on the chat line and I talk to people and they've got different people all over the world in different countries i've had people from italy i've had people from china i've had people from all speaking english of course because i can't speak any language uh, people in America, I haven't had anyone from England yet, but you know, maybe I've not called them that much. But any questions you've got, you can just ask them and they'll put you in touch with somebody who can answer if they can't. And they're really good. The Italian guy is one who got helped me to get me DJ uh, Spark brand new back, uh, especially when I crashed it. And that was really, really good. That, uh, the guy was superb. Stayed with me till I'd done all the details, till it all went through. Uh, he was even going to offer me to use their. Um, email address to send if it mine didn't work which is really good and his, his supervisor told him they're not allowed to do that but uh, in this case they would do it for me but they didn't need to do it in the end so well done to GJI there uh, hope you've enjoyed watching it hope it's helped you in some way if it has you can put the thumbs up and if you think it's rubbish I don't mind just put the thumbs down you know it's still an opinion or if you've got anything else to say just say and if I can answer any of your questions uh, I will do I find a GJI Gets to any country really easy. They don't even question it. When I had my other the phantoms and things like that, it was all humming and ah and checking it out. They've never even looked at this. They all seem to be fascinated what it, uh, what it is. He's done. I was going, ah, you know, the sparkle. You've got the sparkle, and I just smile and say yes. Uh, but I have no problem going to other countries. Uh, easy to carry. And as I say, that one bag what I put down there now. The one bag carry virtually everything. There's a few bits. I can't carry all my charges and all like that, but I'm not going to carry them anyway. Not when I'm going out, when I'm you know, in the field or whatever. So, thanks for tuning in. Uh, hope to see you again sometime. Thank you very much.